one of the key jobs of a point of sale system at a restaurant is to allow a server to say, I want to put a ticket into the system for this table. So in the POS system, you have to have a way to locate the table that you want to put the ticket in for. If you have a view called all tables, these are simply the uh, uh, labels or the way the tables are identified in the restaurant. You click on one, you can start a ticket. Now, the ideal way to do it, uh, the way that is most comfortable to the servers is to have a table view. So you can have a layout of your floor plan of your restaurant, and then the server can select the table based on uh, the way it's arranged in the restaurant. It's faster to learn and easier to understand and easier to remember. In order to do that, you have to create these drawings and put them into the system, and then you can associate your tables with them. So inside Samba POS, tables are actually entities. Uh, so entities have types. So they are entities of type table. So in order to uh, get to the point where you can start putting tables on a view like this, the first thing you have to do is put the tables in the system that you're going to need to use. So for that purpose, we're going to go back out to the main menu. Uh, excuse me. Let me get out of here first. Main menu. There we go. And we're going to go to manage and we're going to go to manage entities. And the entities themselves, we want to work on our tables. So in the room I want to add next, which is the gallery, I have eight tables and they're designated in my system as G1 through eight. So I can do a batch create entities which saves me some keystrokes. And okay, I've now put those new tables, those eight tables into the system. And what I want now is a screen for the gallery that I can associate those tables with. So over here, I'm going to, well, first I'm gonna start by showing you how those screens come into existence. I use Visio as my drawing tool. You can really use anything you want. You can use paint or PowerPoint or whatever and uh, save off your drawing. I'm saving off as PNG or pings. Um, here's the main, uh, dining table layout that I did earlier and here's the gallery layout which I just finished and then I saved that off into a folder on my hard drive and in this example you can see I created a folder called Samba POS and inside that I created a folder called pictures and I dropped those drawings into the folder now that they exist I can go pick those up inside of my uh, POS management interface, uh, I'm going to say, I need to create a new entity screen. And I'm going to call that gallery. And the button label is going to be gallery. And they're looking for a ticket type of ticket. They're looking for custom. And then for appearance, I use the three little dots here to browse out and find my image. So it remembers my last folder location, which is convenient. And I've got the gallery floor plan entered in here. And for my entity list, I'm saying I want to put tables in this view. I want the state to be status. And I'm going to go select those tables that I just created, which were my gallery tables, G1 through 8 and put those over here. Now I've associated those tables with this screen or this view. The next thing I need to do is mappings. And basically what this is saying is for which of these things does this apply? 
and star is a wild card. That means it applies to all terminals. It applies to all user roles. It applies to all departments. It applies to all ticket types. So once that's done, I can click on save. And so for my entity screens, you can see galleries now available. And I'm going, well, I really want that to be, I think what I want is for main dining to be first and gallery to be second. So I'm going to sort my entity screens and I'm going to say main dining and then gallery. That's cool. Uh, all tables is not a very elegant view for the server. So I'm going to make that last. So I'm going to click OK. And then I am going to come out of here and go back to the main menu. Then when I go into the POS, you could see I have Galler, and I've got a typo, so I'll have to go back and fix that. But in there is the view that I created. Now I can start placing uh, tables on that, which we'll show again shortly.